Welcome to this customer installation briefing for setup and configuration of PowerShield over a local area network using a Windows platform. Before you begin, you will need to have your Netman card installed and configured on your network. If not, then please watch the video installation guide or refer to the Netman installation manual. Download and install the UPS Mon.msi software on your PC. This is available from the Riello UPS website. Two new programs will appear in your start menu called UPS Setup and UPS View. Once you are ready for setup, check that the UPS agent service is running by going into Control Panel, Administrative Tools and selecting Services. Now select UPS Setup and you'll see a configuration page. Now select the UPS Connections tab. You'll see a page with a Devices box at the bottom. You will need to add a new device in this box by selecting the Add button. Once you've pressed the Add button, it will open up a new configuration page. If required, under UPS Identification, enter the UPS name. Then enter the UPS PRTK code. This is situated on the rear of the unit. Now there are two types of PRTK codes. For smaller units, it's GPSER11201RU. And for the Master Plus units, it's SENTR19601RU. You have the option to add the UPS serial number below. However, this is not essential. Under Connection, select Remote. Now add in the IP address assigned to that UPS when you set up your Netman card on your network. Next to the IP address, there is a box to enter the device number. Put 1 in this box. At this point, you have the option to configure the UPS and system shutdown parameters. There are two ways that this can be done. Firstly, set shutdown for X number of minutes following a mains failure. Or secondly, when UPS reports Y number of minutes of battery autonomy remaining. Once this is complete, select the OK button. And the configuration will now appear in the device box. Now select OK on the main UPS configuration window. You'll be prompted to save the configuration. You'll also be prompted to restart the UPS agent service. Confirm by pressing OK. Once you've completed this, you have now finished UPS Setup. Go to the UPS View application program. In this program, on the left panel, you have Local and Remote. Click on the arrow next to Local to reveal a list of configured UPS devices. Select the UPS you have just configured and, if completed correctly, you will see a summary report of the UPS status. You are now all set up and can remotely monitor the UPS. Thanks for watching and if you need any further information, please contact us via email at service at riello-ups.co.uk.